Well, good evening, everyone. Uh, my name is Sarasota Jerry. Uh, I just wanted to uh, come on tonight and uh, keep you all updated about uh, how my life's going since I found uh, Scientology and the two heroes of my life, Tampa Brad and L. Ron Hubbard. Uh, my life is, uh, like I said in my last video, my my life and my business is just thriving. I own uh, Sarasota Jerry's Septic Tank Pumping and Hog Trapping Service. And uh, everything has just been so wonderful. And I, I like to keep you all abreast of everything that's happening because uh, uh, I'd like you two to experience what I have in my life. Uh Tampa Brad and L. Ron Hubbard, man, two of the greatest men that ever lived. Really, really. So, uh, there's a few things I wanted to talk to you about tonight. Um, I was uh, at my Scientology org in Tampa uh, uh, last week and uh, getting some more auditing. And uh, it was great as usual. Uh, they got me talking about an incident back in my life when I was eight years old, when I uh, tore the tag off of a mattress that said, do not remove under penalty of law. And uh, that was a big win in my life to get that out of my system. You know, after I was done with my auditing session, uh, uh, I ran into my old friend, the registrar again, and they, they told me that I needed to, uh, uh, sign up for the IAS, which is the International Association of Scientologists, and uh, that that membership was uh, five grand, but if I'd uh, do it by a certain time, uh, it would only be uh, four grand. And uh, then they, they mentioned that uh, L. Ron Hubbard's birthday is coming up next month, and they'd like to get him a a big birthday present of uh, a, a donation. And he says, uh, you can donate to the IAS and, and uh, we'll give you a special status. You know, it will raise your your profile in Scientology. And I said, well, that sounds good. I said, uh, I sure want to do everything that LRH would want me to and that Tampa Brad would want me to. Uh, so I said, uh, I'll be back with the money. Uh, I uh, didn't have that much cash on hand. I, I made quite a bit of money back when I had my uh, meth lab before I gave it up for my current business. and uh, But all that money I, I, I sunk away in 8-track uh, tape players and 1975 Ford Pintos. Um, I always figured that they were ahead of their time back then. Those two things were. And the more of those I collected that someday, someday they would hit and get hot again. And then I'd be a multimillionaire. So I didn't really want to sell any of those for my uh, uh, Scientology. So, uh, you know, I did what, it, what Brad would do. I went and got my beautiful wife again. And we decided to make another OnlyFans video. Oh, you know, a little sexy video to sell and make money with and uh, uh, I took part in this one again with her because I had so much fun in the last one. And uh, in this one, I was uh, playing the uh, owner of a pickle company. And she came in to interview for a job as my secretary. And she was in my office there getting interviewed by me. And, you know, one thing led to another. And before long, I was showing her my gherkin. So, uh, Anyhow, uh, we we did all right with that, and uh, I made the money and came back, and 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 now I'm an official member of the IAS, and I also hold the status of bankruptus meritorious. Uh, so that that means a great deal to me. It really does. Uh, the other thing I wanted to talk to you tonight about is, uh, uh, you know. As Scientologists, we like to go out and live life, too, to the fullest. 
uh, when we could afford to. And uh, uh, I just wanted to give you some ideas about uh, what to do with a significant other in your life on Valentine's Day. I know uh, my wife has been so good doing all these videos for me to make me money so I can get my Scientology paid for. And so I've decided to uh, take her out to uh, the the probably the finest venue for Valentine's Day. And that would be uh, Waffle House. Now, they they do a special at Waffle House on Valentine's Day where you go in and, and they have uh, uh, tablecloths down, which they don't normally have. It's something special, you know. And, and they really have that great ambiance. They don't uh, use candles at your table. What they do is they roll up a couple of slices of uh, country ham into the shape of a candle and stick those in candle holders and light those. That that flame out of a piece of pork fat and uh, and that that smell is, is something you'll never forget. Uh, now for the uh, entree, you know, they have several choices. Uh, I would suggest the quarter inch thick uh, T-bone steak. And uh, uh, don't ever forget to order the uh, hash browns with the jalapenos and the uh, the uh, chili sauce because uh, that combination will give you really this deep down burning love feeling. Uh, for dessert, I suggest the uh, grease, ta uh, grease trap parfait. It's, it's out of this world. You wouldn't even believe it. And to go along with the whole thing, they give you a, uh, a couple of tokens to throw in the old jukebox and uh you can play your favorite uh hank williams jr song while you're dining with your loved one uh, i mean it's really romantic uh you know there aren't any uh depeche mode songs on that jukebox in a waffle house so you don't have to worry about running into any of those big old uh suppressive people like mark headley or anybody like that uh it's it's strictly good music now when you're done uh you know my plans are to uh take the little woman home and uh throw a george jones uh eight track into the old uh eight track player there and uh you know get to messing around a little making out you know and feeling around a little till she gets all hot and bothered and she asked me to uh, whispers in my ear, uh, honey, turn out the light. And so I'll reach over and close the truck door. And uh, that'll be such a great evening, you know. And I owe all these wins and successes in my life to uh, Tampa Brad and Scientology that I'm able to go out and do these things today. And uh, I just want to, uh, again, urge you, if you want to join Scientology and, and, and have what I have, and have what Tampa Brad has, you know, to look up the Scientology nearest to you and tell them uh, Sarasota Jerry sent you. Uh, I'm sure they'll be happy to hear from you. But anyhow, uh, that's all for tonight, my friends. Uh, I'm glad we had this little chat, and I'll catch you later. Bye-bye.